in a moment we'll step into the cemetery and uh, I just want you to have a look around the various inscriptions and stones. Obviously you've been to the cemetery before. Uh, but this is a moment to just take stock. In 72 hours, we perform in front of up to about 400 people. We do. We bring a lot of joy with this production, a lot of silliness, a lot of laughs, a Lady Gaga tribute here, um, a bit of cross-dressing there. There's a lot of levity in the show, which is essential. But like all good stories, Shakespeare offers not just the lighter end of the human experience, but also, frankly, the darker end of the human experience, where two young star-crossed lovers take their lives with misadventured Piscius Grievous. So, just to look at, as it were, the darker end of the human spectrum without getting too heavy about it, is the purpose of reflection in here. Something I will try to endeavour to do uh, with Mark here, uh, filming us, is to just, as we walk around, uh, interview you individually, or perhaps in pairs, just to, to discuss um, the fact that this programme is coming to an end, and what it was meant to you. At the end of this week, we are, frankly, thousands of miles apart from each other, yeah? in different, different parts of the world. And that's kind of exciting, but it's also terrifyingly depressing. Um, but we need to be reconciled to that and be mature about it, you know? There's um, a TV show you must have heard of called Six Feet Under. Uh, it's on HBO, I think, uh, set in amongst uh, a family of undertakers. And it had a tagline for that, that series, which I really would like you to focus on. Everything, everyone, everywhere, ends. Everything, everyone, everywhere, ends. 